13, if I can remember 33, beg your pardon. They just they just turned out the lights on us. <laughs> and he goes against Dakota Gear of Oklahoma State, who is the favorite here. Gear returning All-American and is also in the rankings. Of course, at number 11, he's a redshirt senior, nine and three. And King is 10 and six. He is from Wasega, or Wasega, Minnesota. I'm not sure of their pronunciation. Gear from Franklin, Pennsylvania. By a, eventually by a way of Edinburgh, a transfer from Edinburgh to Oklahoma State. So again, Oklahoma State the favorite here. Stalemate called early. And the only way this could end in anything other than an Oklahoma State victory, even with three straight pins by the Jackrabbits, it would be 22-21. Oklahoma State would have to lose a team point somewhere along the way for unsportsmanlike conduct or something. Otherwise, mathematically, it's basically clinched. Yeah, Gear will, will try to Sharp try a single. <laughs> And he does, and he gets the finish there with the, the other double leg. leg. Got the two. But he likes to push and pull. Great setup series. And if you can, if you can pull, you can snap him down. Otherwise, you're going to go under, which he did. Got the single leg. Switched off to a double from behind. So two nothing gear. Opening minute nine seconds of this one. At match in Columbia, Missouri for Oklahoma State. Sunday is at 2 o'clock Central Time. The Jackrabbits go to OU Sunday for a match at 2 o'clock. Gear, as we've mentioned in other shows, has been susceptible to giving up the leg a lot in the first period, giving up the takedowns. Last, it's nice to see him, though, go out for his sake and actually shoot and score early. Look at his leg there to keep him from keep him from getting to his getting to his feet. Try to lift that leg and tie up those arms and see what kind of pinning, turning combination he can get here. So we mentioned earlier the Jackrabbits only takedown so far through seven weights has been at 141. That one takedown, so Oklahoma State has dominated the match on their feet. Gear with a nice ride up to 111 already. 50 seconds left now in the period. A little bit of jeopardy there, maybe. Mm -hmm. I don't know where uh, got himself in trouble there. Good. And he gave up the two. Good job underneath by King. Tate King. Ten and six on the year. Short time here with 20 seconds on the clock. See if he can get away. Here it is. It's like he just got sloppy there with his positioning. Let him get under the leg and he came through and So here, trying to get out and get that one point to take the lead. And of course, Mr. King does not want to allow that. Five seconds, four, I don't think he's gonna get there. Turns oh, in, nope, did not get it. So two, two, good job by King, hang it on, just enough. Gear's choice, he chooses bottom. I'm guessing he's a little frustrated with himself right now. Wasika, 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 I'm not sure about the pronunciation. PA. All I know is he was on a dairy farm. <laughs> Grew up on a dairy farm there. Gear. Quick escape by Gear. He's up 3 2. Let's see what happens on their feet. Gear with the early takedown. It was very sharp, but things can change. King has to have a little confidence back after getting that nice reversal. I mean, you don't you don't grow up on a dairy farm without having a work ethic. That's right. And he, he he does. He has a good work ethic and he always gets stronger as the match goes along. Mm -hmm. 
So five to two now the score. Try to build some points with takedowns here. Did he just score? I thought he held up two points there. The official, and I don't know why. <laughs> I didn't see it. The escape was given. He held up one for the escape, of course, for Cook or King, rather. So 5-3. Here going to work again, though, but keeping the pressure on King. On King. Yeah, he backed right out. Probably should just get off the mat and get a new start in the center. Oh, the snap down. Picks up the leg, pulls it in, gets across the body. Takedown. Pretty easy takedown there. Yeah. I think he just needs to get to the beef right now. There he goes again, and he scores again. With another third takedown of the match from here makes it 7 3, releases King. 7-4 on the board, right at time 119.9 for gear. 20 seconds left in the second period. Short elbows there. He does. I have him broken down a bit now because the takedowns are coming very, He's got very the major. easy. Yep, he has the major decision. Eight point advantage with riding time. Well, no. Nine four. Here we go. Got the last couple takedowns snapped down, but he missed the. Looks like he missed the major by a point, huh? Yeah, it's nine four right now. So oh, I'm sorry. I thought that was the third period. I got lost there. Here we go. Here we go. And King chooses I mean, bottom. He didn't get lost with. Gear didn't get lost as he ran around those. Optional start. He's scoring so quickly on his feet, you would think maybe he's going to get up to the eight point margin if possible. That would be his goal. Well, that's that push pull action that he's so good at. Yeah, go get up to eight, at. then maybe go for a turn. For try to stick him There's, in the bottom. Nice shot. There's two. two. So 11 5. And riding time with one, is 139 with 142 left in the match. So let's see if he releases him again. Let's figure that would be his strategy. Uh, optional start, yes. Optional start, lets him go, 11-6. Kind of surprised King hasn't been hit with a stalling call, frankly, in this match. He's been all gear on his feet, virtually all the attempts. King giving a lot of ground on his stall running right there, but the double leg right here. He's got the two, so 13 to 6. Now he can ride him out here and get the major. He's going to let him go again. So 13 7. And King looks. He's uh, gas tanks running a little low. Yeah, the thing you want to do here now is is turn your takedowns into back point takedowns. I mean, they've, you've got to follow up the takedown with some kind of pinhole, combine it into a, a, a cradle or a turk or, you know, depending on what kind of finish you're at. That's what you want to do when you're piling up the takedowns. That was a shot by King. It was good to see that. He just couldn't complete it. You're still putting the pressure on. Snap down, doesn't work. Still keeping the pressure on. 30 seconds left. Sure he'd like to get one more with gear just to solidify that major. There, he got to the low single. And he hit Pice out. There it is. So, final 12 seconds, riding time approaching two minutes. 15 to seven is the score. Pushed himself hard, came riding back strong. 204. And that'll be a 16 to seven major decision for Dakota Gears. So, 26 to three, the Cowboys lead it, going into the final two weeks, where the Jackrabbits hope to come back a little bit strong. Come stay with us, you're watching Big 12 now on ESPN Plus.